It's no secret, of course, that Mardi Gras is a big deal in Mobile, the city that started it all. But how does Mardi Gras impact the city's bottom line? WKRG News 5's Nicolette Schleisman is live at the Civic Center, where the Order of Inca will be rolling soon tonight. And Nicolette, it's a rainy night, but uh, that's not going to stop people from coming out to watch the parade. No, it's definitely not going to stop people. You know, I've seen some people still coming downtown. Of course, they've got their rain gear on. You know, just like me, I've got my boots on. But I can tell you, Inca is starting to line up here outside of the Civic Center. And I want to tell you that Visit Mobile says this year, the Mardi Gras season is off to a strong start impacting businesses downtown. Thousands line the streets of Mobile for the dozens of parades throughout the Mardi Gras season. We're a city that's born to celebrate and it really is about happiness. Those thousands of people are spending money and time downtown and according to Visit Mobile, the season has a big impact for the city. Your average person in a parade, I think they buy anywhere from $500 to $1,500 in throws and you multiply that out. I mean, we have 40 parades just in downtown. Mobile alone uh, with and, and some of those parades have at least have as 70 floats. Visit Mobile says about a million visitors come to the city every year during the Mardi Gras season. We spoke with the owner of the Malaga Inn. He couldn't speak with us on camera Friday, but says this time of year is definitely the most important time of year for them. Our restaurants and our hotels go from kind of red to black during that time. Our hotels are sold out particularly downtown as well. Our, our restaurants are busting at the seams. Visit Mobile says the restaurants and hotels stay busy this time of year, which is a big boost to them. They love it and they rely on it. So I just want to thank everyone for supporting it. And as we said, the Inca floats are here lined up outside the Civic Center as they are getting ready to roll in a little less than an hour and a half now. And there are more parades tomorrow, which will be bringing the people and the business downtown. Live in downtown Mobile, Nicolette Schleisman, WKRG News 5.